Hey, this is Alex from Protoplant, makers of Protopasta, and I'm here to bring you 3D in three minutes or less. Today we're going to talk about Protopasta HTPLA. But what's that HT all about? It's about heat treating for higher temperature resistance and improved properties. So let's look at some filament. Here's everyday PLA. Here's some HTPLA. Pretty similar, right? Here is some HDPLA that's been heat treated in an oven. Tough, strong, just like your parts will be after you bake them. Yeah, cool. So that's in room temperature, but what about elevated temperatures like in an oven or a hot car? Let's check out some PLA and HDPLA that's been sitting in the oven here. Look at that. Everyday PLA. Pretty squishy. Here's HTPLA. A lot more firm and rigid still. Really makes a difference. So you're probably wondering, how do I heat treat my parts to get all those better properties? Well, all you need is an oven. This lab one is great. At home oven works. You want to have it preheated with no glowing coils, nothing red glowing inside. You also want to have a nice flat surface to put your parts on and bake them. This is important because your part is going to get soft before it gets firm and then it's going to follow the surface of whatever it's on top of. So if you want to put a flat part in and get a flat part out, put a flat surface in. If your part's something intricate with supports, leave those supports on so that you maintain the part shape. Great, so you want to put your oven at 100 to 130 Celsius in as little as five minutes, you can get a part like this transformed from that. That's right, your part starts all translucent like this and turns opaque. That indicates the change. Now this part only took five minutes because it's super thin. But if you've got a more massive part, it may take a few minutes, uh, as much as an hour. So yeah, there's so much to experiment with. It's really easy and the benefits are really quite clear. So check it out, protopasta.com. Get a sample if you don't already have some. Peace, love, pasta.